Thank you. 
Now, are we ready to get into some more shenanigans, mayhaps? Mayhaps? <laughs> everybody <laughs> welcome welcome thank you so much for joining today i hope you are all doing well very well very well or at least a somewhat decent and for whatever reason i don't know why the chat is not showing up on the screen hmm haven't had that in a while but i can't blame uh what is it? i can't blame stream labs i can't blame uh stream elements there's no one else to blame it's just <laughs> It's just OBS and YouTube! Oh no! <laughs> ah! Yeah, well... Oh well, whatever. You guys aren't new to this. You guys, you guys know the drill! <laughs> we just pretend that you're there. Shenanigans? One would never. <laughs> oh, hello! Welcome, welcome! Thank you so much for joining! Welcome, welcome! And welcome back to Little Goody Two Shoes. Yes, last time on Little Goody Two Shoes, I got, I got a sinus headache, which um, I also had this uh, this past yesterday. I don't know why that took me so long to figure out how to say, but yes, for some reason this game seems to be associated with me and sinus headaches. I don't know why, but uh, anyways. So, we last left off on the 14th of March in the Sunday afternoon, Village Square. Yes. What was I doing? Uh, good question. Oh. I have two dates available and some more story progression and several tasks. Oh man. I don't want to do tasks. I just like pet the dog. Hello? 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 Hi, doggy. You are so cute. Hello. Okay. I need to. All right. Ooh. I need food. <laughs> Mood. But also, <laughs> I should find some in game food too. Okay. So, let's see. I can investigate the notes you found. Lumi, oh, I still can't pronounce her name. <laughs> the nun, the nun person, the nun girl. <laughs> uh, Freya, I can meet her. I have chores. Um, yes, lots of very important, important duties and tasks for me to, uh, to uh, consider. The return of the science issues, <laughs> it's a time. Oh, God, you have no idea. Although it wasn't all in vain, it wasn't all in vain because the reason for, uh, I guess maybe not the reason, but it kind of led up to what happened with all the sinus and whatnot shenanigans. But um, so on Thursday, I I went to see the, the Stardew Valley um, uh, Festival of Seasons concert. That was really fun. <laughs> Oh, it was so fun! Oh, I loved it. <laughs> and I also we also made it a point to because we have uh, relatives that live in that area too. We decided to to go in and visit Crash for a, a short bit, and then I, I I planned to come back to work on on Friday morning. That was the plan. Um, however, I did not accommodate for the fact that that area is uh, very dry, very very dry. I wasn't ready how dry it was going to be and it caused the sinus headache which then led into the nosebleeds so yeah that was fun um <laughs> but aside from that just the the stardew valley concert that was that was phenomenal i am so happy that i got tickets for it and i hope they do another tour and such it was just, it was so good! <laughs> I loved it. 
I loved it. Oh, I can speak with you. Who are you? Chilled. Oh, if it's wonderful seeing the the laddies making merry, is it? Is it? Reminds me of my time with Gretel and your grandmother, Elise. This used to be very close, I remember. Oh, we go up. We got up to some mischief. Some shenanigans. <laughs> That's for certain. It's hard to imagine, if I'm honest. Seeing those laddies run up about gives me hope, Elise. You, Freya, let le, 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 I can't pronounce her name. <laughs> All good girls. I can't say I won't leave this town eventually, Mrs. Mitchell. M M M There's so many names here I can't pronounce. I'm so sorry. Kieferberg's our home, Elise. I would say that alone is worth our while. <laughs> I suppose. You will not leave. You will not leave, Elise. Oh, hello. Who are you, Linda? Elise, are you busy today? I wonder. Do you need anything, Mrs. Linda? I was hoping you collect some eggs for me if you have the time. I've been lending a hand in the alleys, you see. Hmm. Okay, this will consume a food. You know what? Sure. There's no trouble. I can fetch you a few. Oh, thank you, Elise. Careful not to get pecked here. <laughs> Why wait, you feathered rat? <laughs> Stop stealing my children! It's another uh, mini game. This is so random. <laughs> okay, so Waz to move and A E to pick egg. E for egg. E. eggs very quickly. It's like they eat and then bam, egg. I don't think that's how that works, but um, you know what? For the sake of my part-time job, I, 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 I approve. <laughs> Yay, I got a B! No, I'm not going to try again. <laughs> I will, I will leave it at that. <laughs> I passed! Hooray! <laughs> My sis has chickens. Can you refer this is legit? <laughs> I could have done with a few more, but I suppose this will do. You get what you get, Linda. You don't get upset. A few more? No, that's all right. Here you go, Elise. How many eggs can these folks eat in one sitting? Okay. Ooh, I could use some foods. Oh, <laughs> it's because I only <laughs> I only have one food to go off on. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Um. Hold on. Do I have any food with me? Items. Ah, here we go. Eat! Crunch, 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 crunch. Delicious. 
Yeah. And let's let's have one more. Why not? We just ate two whole loaves of bread. You know what? Honestly, mood. <laughs> mood. When there's good bread, you eat it all. Oh, hey! I thought you'd be holed up in church all day, Leb. I'm waiting for Mrs. Old Odilly. She asked me to pray for the rosary with her outside. Said she needs blessings after lending a hand in the alleys. Lending a hand? What's she doing out there? Twittering on about the witch? So I'm told, yes. But I put too much of this nonsense, Leb. You know my answer to that, Elise. It's my duty to make believe with Mrs. Odilly all day. You wouldn't understand. Elise! You'll have me- you'll have me fretting over you at this rate, you know? Aren't you already? No more than you fret over me, unnecessarily, I'll add. Speaking of Mrs. Odilly, she's rather late. I can keep you company until she comes back up like a deep for today. I'm so good. Consume loaf. I have a better idea for you to, for your good deed of the dailies. Moving along to work and stop wasting time. Go on now. I'll be seeing you later. Fine. Bye. Oh, kitty! Hi! Hello, little kitty! It's a little black cat. It's so cute! Hello! I love you. Okay, bye. Can I break in here? Hello? Hello? Let me in! Let me in! <laughs> okay, fine. Kitty evil, no touchy. How dare you? That kitty is far from evil. The kitty's perfect. Oh, hello, Freya. Ah, oh, Elise. Thought you'd be in town. Oh, I just stopped to pay Mrs. Gretel a visit. She's been wanting me to teach this recipe. But I can't seem to find the time. A recipe for what? Oh, I'm so glad you asked, Elise. You see, Pop's a big fan of her honey milk bread, but... Mr. Gustav? He's got the biggest sweet tooth, you know. Now that's a little unexpected. It's the Gap Moe. I've been meaning to learn the recipe is all. Why not get it from Mrs. Gretel's? <sighs> it's a little embarrassing, but... Papa... Well... He's always said that... Um... <sighs> you don't have to tell me, Freya. He says he likes my cooking big better because it's... Um... Made with love? Oh, I know, Elise. It's so... He's so embarrassing. <laughs> he's just a big softy. I want more bread. Hello. Granny, I would like to buy... Um... Let's see. I will get some bread. Yeah. Two breads. And some more matches. There we go. And then a single pretzel. That sounds delicious. A soft pretzel would be amazing right now. Kitty evil? Dang. What what kitty hurt you? How could you not see the pure joy and love from Kitty? Look at this! How could you not love the kitty? How could you not love the kitty? You saw the chickens poking my fingers off and you're saying cats are evil? I guess I, <laughs> I guess I missed all the romantic events in the afternoon. Oopsie, but that's okay. Um, I can re meet Rosa Marie at the backyard at dusk. 
I could do that if I so choose. Play kiss the rat with the kids? What? <laughs> what kind of game is that? That's hilarious. God, there's so much to do. I'm like, low-key kind of lost. There's so many cats. I keep pressing the caps key instead of shift to run. It's this is very inconvenient that I have to press my use my pinky to press shift. Okay, let's save here. Whoop. Whoop. Ah. There we go. Okay. You know what? Let's let's go empty file number one. Where am I going? Let's not wander about too far. Oh. What was that? That was weird. Was that on purpose? Or was that just a weird glitch? Hmm. I don't like that. <laughs> I didn't like that. Where am I? Hold on. Oh, I'm at the woodland. Oh, I see. I see. That's why I can't go further. Gotcha. Gotcha. I gotcha. Gotcha. I assume it's normal, but is it only is it normal to have only the one shift button work? Because the other one doesn't want to work. Oh. <laughs> I just <laughs> I pressed shift like too many times. It's asking if I want to turn on sticky keys. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Jeez. Where am I off to? Key for view viewpoint, key for repeat. Key for bar, 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 bar. Where do I have to go? Ah, up here. I see, I see. In Elise's backyard. <gasps> oh, oh, excuse me. <sighs> oh, are you? Please stop embarrassing yourself, new people might be watching. Hey, they get the experience firsthand of me being an absolute girl failure, okay? Isn't that why y'all have stuck around? Oh, hello? What this? Would you like to revisit the game's tutorials? No. <laughs> it's my house clean and not broken into. Why do you carry all your food with you? If there's, if you have a pantry, why don't you like put the food in the pantry? Oh, hello! What, what was your name again? Fluck! Hello! Ought to be nice to be a goat, huh? Man, I wish I was a goat. <laughs> that one care in the world, oblivious to everything. Damn. I wish I could be a goat. <laughs> the greatest of all time. Oh, there's Rose and Muddy. Here she is. I'll spend some time with her. Yeah.
I forgot how loud the voices were. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Elise. All right, I was voicing these characters. Um. <clears throat> okay. I didn't know you'd be back so soon, Elise. <laughs> I still ought to head back to town, mind you. What are you doing standing out here? <laughs> oh, just waiting for the stars to come out is all. Oh, girl, same! <laughs> I'm here, though, so... <laughs> hmm. A little too early for stars, don't you think? I find it helps me air out my thoughts. Air out your thoughts, you say? I'm waiting for the waxing crescent. It's important, important I set my sights on what's to come. The sooner the better. What do you mean, Rosamarine? Oh, that's... You see, Elise... I've dreamt about you before. About Kieferberg, too. Last night? Or... I know this may sound strange, but... I didn't quite stumble upon Kieferberg by accident. What do you mean? Do you leave... I ruined a really good, perfectly good moment. Let me try that again. <clears throat> do you really believe in fate, Elise? I don't know. I've never given it much thought. Then you most likely won't believe what I have to say, but... It's fate, Elise. I've always known my fate was with you, Elise. She's like, what? I was all, what? Huh? It's too soon to be having this conversation. If I'm honest, hmm. I meant to wait until you were ready, but... Rosemarine... I don't understand, Rosemarine. Ready for what? <laughs> You'll know in time. For goodness sake. What's with all this mystery? Out with it, Rosemarine. What are you trying to tell me? It took me quite some time to make sense of it myself, but... Everything's feeling so strangely nostalgic to me. Hmm. Nostalgic, you say? Your name, your voice, your home, this breeze even, all that surrounds you. So much of it feels like home to me. Rosemarine. That's not possible, Rosemarine. Elise. It's you the stars told me about, Elise. I didn't say nothing. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm certain now. Never in my life have I ever heard such nonsense. And yet, I'm covered in goosebumps. <laughs> I can tell you don't believe one word of what I just said. Rosemarine. Rosemarine, I... I think I'll stay out here for a little while longer, if that's all right. <laughs> I promise I won't be late for supper. Uh, all right. Don't stay out here too long, you hear? Yes. I won't, I won't. A heart piece has been acquired! <laughs> Amazing. Well, that was fun. Oh, good old evening time. Give a love heart after every successful date. Check your progress on the relationship menu. I'm assuming that was <laughs> I assume that was successful. <laughs> oh, it's getting kind of dark. Oh, I'm finally done with work for today. Yay! I better head over to to Mrs. Gretel's to see Lib Lib Lab. <laughs> Let's settle down and eat. Um, nom, 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 nom. What did you tell her? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think. I don't think I told her anything. <laughs> Would you like me to start making dinner for us for tomorrow, Elise? Hmm. That's not a bad idea in itself, but. 
to know you won't make a mess of it. The last thing I want is to spend my evenings in the outhouse. <laughs> I'll have you know I'm a proper cuckolies. Everyone's in my seat, Granny, to disapprove of anything I prepared. <sighs> well, I suppose it can't do much harm. All right. On that note, Rosemarine, you're to sleep in the attic from now on. I can have you hanging around the granary and I'll bring all the dust and cobwebs inside. Oh, but I... Oh, I can clean it up for you, Elise. It's really no trouble. Hmm. I've had my fill of running about looking for you day and night. Uh, but... Oh, Elise, I wouldn't want to be a bother. Oh, shush it! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> and I wouldn't want you nesting with the mice and geckos. You're sleeping in the attic and that's final, you hear? I'm letting you sleep inside where it's perfectly warm and... Did you hear that, Rosemary? Hear what? I'm taking the broom. You stay here just in case. I'll be in the trouble! <gasps> Who's that? Muffy? Muffy? It's you! <laughs> she got <laughs> Hello! <laughs> uh, please spare me, Elise! Muffy! What in the Lord's name are you doing here, Muffy? Uh, or Miffy? Uh, Miffy? Uh, Muffy? What's her name? <laughs> I, I was on a stroll! I, I swear! I swear on my auntie's name! Is that so? Ah, and you just so happen to hide behind my house, I see. You sneak about folks' homes every now and then, too, don't you? Uh, what are you doing here, Mandy? Mandy? What is her name? <laughs> Tell me right now or I'll scrub your mouth with soap this very minute. Teak. It's getting quite late, isn't it, Elise? I best... Out with it! I, I saw her! <laughs> You're housing, Elise! <laughs> you saw nothing, Molly. Why does she keep calling all of her different names? She's not far out here. Even I can tell. Y you were having... S oh, okay. <laughs> Interesting. Y you were having supper together and, and everything, Elise. Uh. You keep your mouth shut, Mubby. Or <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, no. Oh, girl just wants some food. <laughs> Why don't you share some of that bread you got, Elise? I might get keep quiet if you do. For goodness sake! Oh, I should have guessed that's what you wanted. Hmm. Here, give you a bread. A single bread. If I hear as much a word about this, Molly. Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> Girl, we got that bread! Elise, why don't you bring me a pretzel tomorrow? Out with it! Mouth shut or I'll throw you into the well. <laughs> Yay, suspicion down. Get out of here. Go on, get. <gasps> and don't come back. Or else. For goodness sake. <sighs> this is the last thing I needed. I'm sorry, I... Is she gone? Mm. This could be so bad, Rosemarine. <sighs> I'm sorry. Oh, Elise... I generally didn't see her. I would have told you if I had. Uh, Why don't you start fretting now, too? You think she'll tell anyone? Mm. If she does, we could be... Uh, in trouble. I know, Rosemarine. I'm sorry. It's I... Rosemarine. Shush it, you. Oh, shush. I'm heading back inside. Uh, yes. Okay, so it seems like Elise tends to get people's names wrong. Interesting. Us talking to you never the same name twice. <laughs> <laughs> Too real. Oh god, I'm Muffy then. Muffy's spying you. Fulfill her daily request for food items to keep her from snitching and raising suspicion. Oh. Mind what you say and do your best to avoid suspicion towards Elise or bear the consequences. Uh oh. Hold on. Don't forget. Yes, I need to meet her at the, the bakery. I'm gonna go out and meet her at the bakery. Whee! 
Oh, I'm just gonna run into the into the walls, you know, ever so casually. stars isn't real how dare you how dare you <laughs> she's real she's just uh... oh hello hey girly here you are love you're a little too happy to see me aren't you oh i thought today would never end that's all you do look tired elise these folks will be the death of me, that's what. Running over this witch nonsense day and night. You know they're rather superstitious, Elise. Oh, you're buying into it in two? Now too? What's next? We're all sleeping in the church together like chickens in a coop? Elise! It's all nonsense, Lev. Everyone's losing their wits. Here's your bread, Elise. I acquired two bread yet. Did you make too much today, or something? I felt you could use a little more than usual tonight. You need to look after yourself, Elise. Lev's always had a talent for figuring things out, but is this her intuition again, or... Move along, Elise, before it gets late. I I'll see you tomorrow, Lev. Interesting. Okay, cool. So I got I got some more bread. Awesome. I appreciate that. Yay. Yay, bread. We get it run reading of stars went to a farm where she can run around forever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just where the one brain cell of reading of stars just kind of goes Wee! <laughs> She's free range She's organic <laughs> do -do 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 -do. You know, let's save before I uh, before I make a mess of things No, not that one. This one. No. It was this one. Okay. <laughs> I was like, which one did I recently save in? It was this one. Oh, and then a bluebird clock. You know what? Actually, I'm going to try something. There are control settings. I'm going to try these. These settings. Okay, this might be a little bit easier for me to to navigate with. Up. Elise. I'm heading off to bed, Rosemarine. I can spend the night in the greenery if you'd like. No, I meant what I said. You're sleeping in the attic. I'll meet with you upstairs. Uh, all right. All right here. Up we go. Are the vines going to attack me again? Are you going to attack me again? Granny Holly used to love this thing, didn't she? I never truly understood why exactly. Especially since it like attacked me the other night and I was like, the heck? <laughs> so much for seeing Wellperga's protection. I'd have thrown you out long ago, lassie. 
Palms joined in prayer. The wooden statue of St. Walpurga grants protection to the faithful. Mm, he left that goat in the granary, I'm hoping. Uh, of course. <laughs> I left the door ajar so he can go in and out and about if he wants. What makes you think he'll stay put? <laughs> By the bed I made him, of course. You ought to see it, Elise. Huh. I'm not going out of my way to see a goat's hay bed, Rosemarine. Up you go. You need to make your bed, too. <sighs> You'll make do, I'm certain. Oh, it's perfect! I'll get you a blanket, too. I can't have you sleeping on hay. Why not? For goodness sake. You're not a goat, Rosemarine. <laughs> I could be a thief, yet you're trusting me with a blanket? For goodness sake. I don't see what's so funny. Please. You truly are kind, Elise. I can see that clearly now. Shush oh, shush. I'll be glad to take that blanket, Elise. I'll get you some matches, too. And a candle. <laughs> Thank you, Elise. It's bedtime now. I need some rest. Good night, Rosemarine. Good night, Elise. <laughs> oh, dear, there's only one bed. <laughs> there is only one bed, but she is perfectly fine on a, on a bed of hay. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. We're not at that part yet. <laughs> oh, nice and tucked in. For goodness sake. What am I getting myself into? First I greased the house, Mo Rosemarine. Now Miffy's caught one of it, too? I must make sense of this all by tomorrow. If only I can leave this town. Go somewhere far, far away from here. A place where I never have to fret about money or going hungry, like a castle or palace. Somewhere where I can live the life I deserve. Girly same. That doesn't look right. Huh? Wait, huh? Where... Where am I? What is this? Is this a dream? <gasps> First game where you play is a Tsun Tsun. <laughs> Honestly. Hello? Explore the room. Oh, but first before I do that, I am going to... Eat some food. Eat some bread. There we go. It's so bright, I can hardly see. The blindingly warm light pierces the window's glass panes, creating cradling the room in a welcoming glow. What's in here? It's locked, it seems. Oh, no, but there's something nice inside, too. Oh. Golden Girl? Betty White? Rebirth. That's what I wished for. You wanted to be reborn? Somewhere safe. Somewhere far, far away. I went through all of their childs, gathered all of his gifts. And? Indeed, I was reborn. My wish was granted yet. Yet. I think I would end up like this. Wait! What was that? Oh. I got some grapes! Oh! Stay sane. Keep Elise from feeling frightened with sandy healing items or she might go mad. What? I feel like I'm in a princess's bedroom! 
If only I could live here, just like I've always dreamed. <laughs> oh. Okay. There are all sorts of dangers lurking in the shadows. You healing items to per persevere and survive. Okay. What in the world? Oh, I got a key. The items in your inventory can have effects on the environment. Try using the glove on them. Objective, leave the room. Oh! Yeah, I guess I can leave the room now. I'm locked in here, I suppose. Can't say I minded much if I'm honest. Well, this is, uh, slightly disturbing. <gasps> Such a long corridor! It truly feels as though I'm inside a palace! Star versus Spooky. Oh, God. I don't like this. What? I have a bad feeling about this. things. Feeling lost? Don't forget to turn on your lantern and keep an eye out. Oh, I see it. Oh, I see it. Four keyholes? What? I need four keys! Damn! Okay. I don't like this. it open. Ooh, phantasm key. Yeah. Whoa. It's a key. This is what will get me out of here, I'm certain. Guys, oh. <laughs> this is making me nervous. <sighs> it makes a door with four keyholes. Someone's trying to torture me, I guess. A bunch of purple flowers sag lazily over their vase.
bandages. Oh, I could use that. Huh? That's me? Huh? Girl, what would you do? <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> Ow! Ah, shoot! I didn't realize that's what happened. Ooh, I don't like that glitching effect. Okay, if I just outrun them, then they don't get me. That's good. Ow! Shoot! Where's that last key? Or do I have? Oh, did I just, did I just? What did I do? Ah! I ulted out the, ah! <laughs> I ulted out of the window! Ah! <laughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. Everything's fine, <laughs> everything is fine. <laughs> I'm fine. Okay, let me take a look at what items I have. I have three keys. Okay, I have three keys, but where's the last one? Damn, where tis the last key? Look on the bright side, no blue vines, yeah. <laughs> I don't like that moon in the corner. Why is it, it's, it's got blood around its mouth and I don't like those eyes, that's scaring me. <laughs> I don't appreciate this. <laughs> the key to the depths of one's desire. Huh? These are all in different language. I can't make sense of any of these titles. What? Oh jeez. Okay. Um okay, so I got I got two from this side and I've only gotten one from this side. I'm just trying to figure out where the heck this fourth key would be. So they come back, they spawn back, so that's annoying. I wonder, is there like another key down here though? Holstered in luxurious blue velvet. This the broad, uh, I almost read that was the bread sofa. The broad sofa was surrounded by similarly luxurious furniture. Oh my god, I can't read any of these books while I'm trapped in a scary haunted mansion with flying candles that are trying to burn me alive. I know! How could this even be possible? that last key. Ah!
So there's that chest. Oh, it's right here! Oh, I'm so silly! I didn't even notice it! Oh. What's this? The key to one's dream is found within oneself. As for yours, it's in this very room, the core of your innermost desire. It's not knowledge you seek, but gold bay's glory. What? What? Now what's that supposed to mean? Gold bay's glory? very good at this, all right. <laughs> I'm not very good at this. Hold on. <laughs> Let me heal. <laughs> Let's have some grapes, man. <laughs> Let's have some grapes. <laughs> but gold there's something on the back of the shelf i have to reach out my arm to get it but this is it this is yeah here it is the last key it's a key this is what will get me out of here i'm certain Yeet! oh not again okay okay I got the keys. <laughs> I got the keys, guys. <laughs> the key items. All the keys. This is it. Yay. Huh? Where am I? What is this? Took the words right out of my mouth, girly. I must be dreaming. Why? I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Okay. Candles. Um. The illusion of 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 owning a house. I know that all too well. <laughs> Are those pumpkins or apples or what the heck? <laughs> huh? Hurry now, hurry now! We're late for his banquet! What? What are you? Good job making out of the house. Your reward is the endless black expanse of nothingness with hallucinations. Hurry, hurry! Huh? <laughs> well, at least it didn't attack me, but like... What? <laughs> okay, this is very much giving like... Oh, this is weird. I was just gonna say, this this whole sequence is kind of giving, like, you know, in Snow White, where that there was, like, that one, like, the forest sequence where she was, like, running away, but she was, like, in the forest, and she was, like, ah! <laughs> she was just, like, scared out of her mind. That's what it kind of reminded me of. What a weird-ass dream that was! <laughs> Girly! 
Girl, are you good? Uh, I left me feeling a little queasy. You don't say. Rose and Marine? Are you there? She's most likely still asleep anyway. Mm. No point in waiting here this early, I suppose. All right, that was weird. Oh, she's up cleaning already. Girly. Good morning, Elise. I would have got a head start on breakfast if I knew you'd be waking up this early. For goodness sake. Since when have you been up? <laughs> Oh, I'm always up and trying in about before daybreak. I can't sleep as if I try. Hmm. I didn't notice you coming down from the attic. I brought the ladder up with me last night so I wouldn't wake you. And the Hutchison's squeaky if you do it slowly, right? I took my shoes off and used the ladder to shut it back up. Easy. <laughs> You're smarter than you look, huh? <laughs> I look as smart as I am, Elise. Is that so? Uh... Anyhow, I'm heading off to the garden. The garden? You mean the field just outside? Is it that obvious I haven't touched in years? I've been working like a dog since Granny Holly passed, but now I have you to fret about too. I can't just sit on my hands forever, can I? Elise. What? You'd rather starve? Join me as mate of all work bats. <laughs> you truly are kind, aren't you? Shush it, you. I don't like compliments, but keep giving them to me anyway. <laughs> I'm heading out to see what I can do about the garden. I'll call you in for breakfast in a moment, then. This is so domestic! Ah! So cute! Uh, for goodness sake. I don't want to do any work. I have neglected it for so long. It'll be impossible to dig. <laughs> Anyhow, this is no time to loiter about. Guys, it's farm game. What? A pair of shoes? How could they possibly wound up here in my garden? Oh, they're wonderful! And they fit me like a glove, too! These shoes! Whoa. This is how they were made for me! What kind of shoes were we wearing before? I did it! All of Kieferberg needs to hear about this! They certainly match the dress very, very well. Fun game. <laughs> the Ocho Sama laugh. Oh, girl, he's losing it. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> well, that was fun. Um. <clears throat> what? Oh, shush it! Explain. What is there to explain, father? Did I not hear myself? Was I just going in like some random like, just feel after putting on the shoes? 
Preparing the slight wall for your place of worship, howling and shouting like a please, old Trojan. <laughs> Words of egotism, vanity, disdain for your fellow folk. <laughs> I always knew you were wicked, you arrogant lassie. You old geezer! Why, you? A witch? A witch of old Holly's kin! I am not a witch, you! Oh, listen here, you old wretch! That's enough! Yeah, indeed he has overstepped his boundaries. Huh? Oh, I wasn't aware seeing and dancing was forbidden now, father! <sighs> was it riddled with sin, really? Fancy and lust go hand in hand with greed. Oh, what does this have to do with sin, father? This old geezer just accused me and my grandmother of witchery, yet. <sighs> Bro. Compose yourself and come inside. Your temperament is of sin in of itself. Damn. Hmm. Fine. I guess I'll repent for something I didn't do if it makes you happy. <sighs> There's something I'd like to make clear to you all. You stood witness to this foolery. You've all heard old Joe Chen accuse me of witchery. <clears throat> you asked me to pardon him yourself, father. And I will. Yet I demand you folks understand this once and for all. Out with it! I am not a mere maid of all work. I am one of you. And I demand right here, right now, that you start treating me as such. <sighs> huh? Without a shadow of a doubt, lass. <gasps> At last, he's made his move. <gasps> Who are you? An old acquaintance of yours, alas. What? You're favored by him, Elise. Frightfully so. You're clad in his will from head to toe inside out. And those shoes. My shoes? Those very shoes, Elise, are a testament of his gift to you. Who is he? Listen carefully now, my beautiful lass. <gasps> Get away from me! Yours is his heritage. His flesh, his ador, his ardor. Don't you understand, Elise? What in the Lord's name? How do you know my name? His blessings, his will, he himself is writhing in your veins, lass. What do you want from me, you old hag? You must listen carefully now, my beloved. Do as I say, and he will make all your wishes come true. What? My wishes, you say? Ah, yes, opulent splendor of fortune. Your deepest desire is unlike any other, Elise. I, I don't understand. You do, Elise. Tell me, what is your most desire? What is it you most desire? Me? Speak it, Elise. Mm. What I most desire, that's fortune. Fortunate you are, Elise. I think I just made a deal with the devil. Deep in this woodland, there is a patron saint. With blissful words bestows a blessing upon those feet. All that's requested in return are the three gifts made from the testaments to one's desire. Reach his dwelling with all these in hand, and your wish shall be granted. Um, a carrier of life, your basket is to hold all that is sacred. Crows! <gasps> the tender flesh of earthly desire. Snake. The sweetest nectar to be drunk in urns. You are to arrive in good company, the object of your affections. You are to reach the gates of his dwelling, carrying all three gifts. Voice your innermost desire, surrender yourself wholly to his grace. What? 
And fortune you shall attain, for such is his blessing, and such is your desire. What? Elise? Elise, are you listening? <gasps> Where did she go? Elise. Elise, are you all right? Where did that old hag go? Elise? What's the matter with you? Lebkuhen. Oh, Lebkuhen. Oh, that's how you say her name! Lebkuhen. Okay. Okay, it's good to hear a character say it out loud. <laughs> oh, I'm... I, I'm sorry, Leb. It's best we let her rest a while. We can sit with you, Elise. Oh, it's best we give her some space, Jacob. I'm alright. I... I felt a bit dizzy is all. I can bring you some water, Elise. As for me, I'll be in the church waiting to have a word with you. Don't you start, Leb. Oh, I've already started. My, now you've done it, Elise. Uh... For goodness sake. Well, that's, um... That's interesting. Hmm. All right, fun, fun, fun. Well, all right. I guess let's go into the church and see what happens from there. Hey. Let me just take a look at the map first before I... Okay. Nothing else really much to do except except work, get some money. But before we do that, let's have a word with Leb. Leb Kuchin. I'm here for my earful, I suppose. You're no child, Elise. For goodness sake. I'll spare you, Elise. You're aware you've said too much. I could have stayed silent, you know that. I agree it was their fault, Elise, but... We both know this will only get you the wrong kind of attention. Well, Jochen's to be exact. I'm well aware, Leb Kuchin. There's no real need for you to fret over this, you know. There is the utmost need for me to fret over it, Elise. I'll keep Father Hans from dwelling on it too much. <sighs> All right. Why don't you meet me here at dusk, Elise? We could both use a little downtime, wouldn't you say? I'll be here. Will I? It said meet with the uh, with the object of my affection. So I have to bring my girlfriend to unknown certainty of 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 darkness. <laughs> uh oh, that's not good. <laughs> I don't think she'll agree to go with me. <laughs> what other things do I need to do? Investigate the notes you found. How do I investigate the notes? I don't understand. How does one do that? How does one do that? Oh. Hey, Freya. Miley's, look at those shoes. Really, do truly does look best on you, Elise. Why, thank you. Oh, you have to wear them to the festival, Elise. Now's the time to find yourself a proper suitor, Elise. Uh, that's precisely what we were chatting about with Freya. Uh, oh, yes! Aren't I a little too young to be looking for a husband? Why, the sooner the better, I'd say. That's not exactly what I'd like to be doing with my time, if I'm honest. I used to feel the same way until I met Finn. Oh, you'll see. I'd say Freya's got a good chance of meeting her future husband soon. Oh, Mrs. Brunhild, I wouldn't say I'm... You're quite the cadge, isn't she, Dorothea? 
Oh, Freya is the catch! Uh, in truth, I... I do feel the same as Elise. My interests lie elsewhere, you see. Oh, you don't mean... Sewing! <clears throat> and I have my hands full with the festival, too. This really isn't the time. Oh, that reminds me. Would you come by and meet me by the well at dusk today, Le Elise? Oh, uh, yes, I suppose. Girls these days, huh? Wait till we'll come around, I'm certain. Oh man, everybody wants to meet at dusk, and I am absolutely not going to be meeting them at dusk. Oh, where am I? Oh, I haven't been to this part yet. Oh, hello? I don't even remember he used to live here. And this cozy nook the old home waits to be consumed by the overgrowth. Odili, oh, it's, it's Miss Odili. Oh, how dreadful. Look what that windstorm did to our poor Alex. It did away with a few things, I see. You made too little of it, Elise. I don't know what else there is to say about the windstorm, Mrs. Odilly. Most of the town folks have already put, put it behind them, so why can't you? Oh, Jojen's just as concerned as I am, lass. And for good reason. Oh, here we go again with old Jochen. Ah, that reminds me. I can assure you, Miss Odilly, these shoes aren't... Old Wilhelm's making a rosary for my precious granddaughter, Gisela. You see? Won't you go please see if it's ready for me, Elise? I, I suppose. Sure. <sighs> oh, oh, excuse me. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's not the way. <laughs> Misses the obvious stairs and tries to go through the hole. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm back here. Nice. So I did a little loop de loop. That's what kids call it these days. Sewing, <laughs> exactly. I'm interested in sewing. Yes, yes, sewing. <laughs> oh, excuse me. here for today. No, a little bit of a shorter stream, but you know, you, you guys will be seeing a lot of me tomorrow. <laughs> a lot more than you probably would like. <laughs> and I will probably be losing my mind. So, thank you everybody so much for joining me for some more little goody two shoes. Hopefully at some point I'll be able to, um, <laughs> I will be able to stream this for longer than an hour. <laughs> But man, there's just, there's so much to this game. It's almost a little overwhelming, but I do find the story very fascinating, so. And we're just starting to get into the meat of it, I think. So. Yeah. Thank you guys for taking the time out of your day to join me in these lovely streaming activities. And I hope you have a great rest of your day as well. Take care. Make sure you hydrate. Get something tasty and be prepared for 12 hours of Tetris tomorrow. Oh boy, that's gonna be fun. <laughs> and as always, until we meet again, bye bye. We like girls. We're never coming around. <laughs> We will always be we will always be interested in sewing. <laughs> All right, bye guys. Bye bye.